Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel, and uh, Microsoft has this way of always making things complicated. And one of the features that a lot of people would have enjoyed having for a long time is the ability to name their account at setup in such a way that, you know, the folders and the account uh, info is not this weird string of characters or uh, just, you know, your part of your email. So, for example, if you go here in the File Explorer and I go to my user account folder, uh, it gives me this, you know, weird name derived from the email I use in my Microsoft account, which is nonsense. This should be something that we name and that is logical and what we want. Now, for the first time, Microsoft is allowing this to happen in Windows 11. The problem is no one will do it because it's too complicated. And the reason it is is because when you set up a new Windows 11, uh, you will have to do all of these commands. You'll have to do the Shift and F10 option to open the command prompt. Then you'll have to do CD or OBE to go into the proper folder. And then you'll go to set default user folder dot CMD command. You'll have the ability to enter up to 16 characters and only Unicode characters, nothing special, nothing weird. And then you'll continue with the Microsoft sign in in the account and so on and so on and so on. Yeah, really, Microsoft, why don't you just ask in the setup what name do you want to have your user account on Windows is? Just that. Ain't that the simplest way to do it? But of course you can't because Microsoft is always complicated. But at least for the first time, that's now possible, as it was never possible before. So it was always a default of either your uh, email. And if you had a Microsoft uh, a user account, just your, you know, no Microsoft account, it was even worse. It was one of those weird cryptic names that was automatically done by Windows. Uh, so, uh, well, one step forward, but uh, it's kind of a nonsense to do it that way. Hopefully, Microsoft will wake up and somebody at Microsoft might be, you know, a, a geek, but a geek that's going to say, yeah, but, you know, for regular people, it doesn't work. If you enjoyed my videos, please subscribe. Give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.